32 on the Doppler That's normal Party on the weeknights Nocturnal The county of kings I'm looking for a queen Get it in by any means I'm a three What's good? It's your boy Johnny Bousque the ATV team of Robert Lane Studios. When I ain't producing beats, writing songs, I'm sitting at home watching that GTV. You already know it, Northwest Highlight Show. Let's get it. West most major city U.S. though. That's us. Let's all stand up, hands up like new. Mic check one two oh six. Yo, chick wet when I come smooth. I'm rolling through the rain city with a sunroof. Jet city gates open up for Billy Bill Palmer. Some great names I can name plenty. Come on, Ellison Chains. Here we're live in the studios here with uh, at the Robert Lane Studios here with Mr. Johnny Boucher. My guest today, well, I'm his guest. Fortunately, we had the uh, privilege of being able to come down here to Robert Lane Studios and get a chance to talk to Mr. Boucher. What's happening with you today? Shit, man. I'm uh, from Johnny Bousquet. Bousquet, got you, got you. Bousquet, I'm trying to figure it out now. Uh -huh. I'm glad that you guys are here. Uh, come see what we do. I mean, this is basically my home away from home. So yeah. That's what we do. It's an exclusive home, as you can see, it's a state of the art studio. Why don't you give us a little explanation of uh, what you're working with here? What's that, man? Uh, SSL 4000G. Big board. Yeah. Over here, got some really good stuff. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right here, so I like your fan stuff right here. Basically, what you got is anything you ever need. I like to wear my vocals through the man. Well, that, and now, can you explain something to me about this man? Would that make me sound like a million dollars? What's the right producer? Anybody can sound like a million dollars. That's what I'm talking about. You know? And that's, that's what we do here, man. We, we specialize in bringing out the best in the artists, man. Anybody we work with, we build custom songs around that. We, we listen to the artists and, and put as a common goal. You can make a lot of big things happen. You know what I'm saying? So, I, like the, I like the way you put that, man. That's what I'm saying. How much do y'all charge per hour? Yeah, uh, we do 12 hour days. Wow. And, and, uh, so basically, uh, you come in and book a whole slot, a whole day, and mm -hmm. do what you need to do. And you're in some exclusive, you're working with some exclusive equipment. So if we're talking the high end of studio rent. It is. And, yeah. and you, I mean, our, our staff and engineers, they, they've worked hard to prove that they do what they do. I mean, you can look them up, <laughs> check out their names, and they. They've done what they've done to be here, so I mean, they're gonna get a high quality radio sound. Right. So give me a little uh, description about your background. What, what, uh, when you first started getting into music, what made you decide that music was your thing and your passion? Man, I'm, uh, I'm originally from Oxnard, California. That's about 30, 40 miles north of LA. And uh, when I was 11 years old, I bumped into Dr. Dre, Easy, and Ice Cube at golf and stuff. And uh, be before that, I was already a big fan. I mean, that's that's what was happening in my neighborhood and stuff. And, and since I was a kid, I could remember listening to the radio and the, you know that F the Police. <laughs> yeah, just, just all that good stuff. Easy does it, man. And, and I remember how Cube wrote all those songs and right. him and Dre put that together. And, and just, just the way that happened. I remember we went home that night. I was, we were all, we were all rapping, you know, their songs. Just yes, move, man. Yeah. And, and, and something happened. And, and mm -hmm. since then, I. Mm -hmm. don't, don't really, the music don't matter. I've, I've seen some of your work and the stuff that you've worked on, and you got a, a wide variety of music genres that you can hang yourself with. But would you say that maybe like kind of rap and hip hop is kind of your, you know, your passion? Or is that what moves you, makes you shake your body, whatever? Yeah, man. I mean, hip hip hop, rap. I mean, any anything to do with. We're just getting down, really getting down, and, uh -huh. and telling the story. And, and, and hip hop's been able to tell about where I come from. I don't care. Okay. I haven't. I haven't. I didn't grow up with the silver spoon and stuff. I'm, I'm from the dirt. You know, okay, I from, okay. I come from a long giant line of drug addicts and dead kids, You know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, for me to be alive at this point. Keep it real, Johnny. That's good, man. 
Outstanding. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about your uh, your education and whatnot as far as the music is being concerned. Well, uh, a lot of it's been just doing it, but I did go to Shoreline and uh, mess around with the audio engineering and the mini music production there. And, uh, they got an outstanding program I'm learning at. I, I participated there for about two or three quarters. So. Yeah, they have, they have a really, really great staff that uh, believed in me and encouraged me. I mean, they weren't, they weren't easy on me, man. I didn't uh -huh. get nothing easy, but... I learned what I learned and, and it's, it's been beneficial to my career. You know, yeah. When I was going to school, we dreamed about you know, working in a place like this. Man, I was in Dallas and the big dogs. Yeah. And, and, I mean, instead of talking about it, we get to come here and do it on a daily basis. So, so tell me about some of the people then that you have worked with. You know, I don't I don't like to toot my own horn. Hey, I want to yeah. hear it though, man. We need to hear it. Yeah, I'm, I'm happy to. With, my my biggest thing is who I'm about to work with. Oh, let's go there. I gotta be honest, and, and you know what? I don't I don't always know that. I know I'm working on Billy Patrol stuff. Uh -huh. You know, I know I'm I'm working on a lot of other stuff. Yeah, I mean, like, yeah. I'm working on Jory's whole album, man. This whole album is going to be crazy. Yeah. Now, Jordy is, is, is a, a guy that we just covered here on GTV. And um, he's a aspiring uh, football star for the University of Washington, fresh off the Independence Bowl win. My Alamada, I might add. And I just wanted to let that be known. And we've been featuring his uh, song and his video on GTV and Northwest Highlight Show. And this year, is the producer of that. So, um, since he's in, uh, it'd be safe to say then that uh, any future uh, projects that you got coming down the line, you're going to keep what's online with it, right? Man, you already know. Man. That's what I'm talking about. It's, it's 110 with it. Okay, okay. Yeah. Well, here it is. Here we got our guy, Mr. Johnny Boucher. 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 Hey. Here from Robert Lane Studios. Coming in for me live here on GTV.